this is a pretty big haul from Sam's and HEB. So stay tuned. Hey you guys, welcome back to Alicia at Home. I am Alicia. Today I am coming with a quick video. I'm gonna be doing a grocery haul. I've already gotten my items and I have them in there just waiting to show you all. Um, I picked them up from Sam's Club and from HEB. I, I did a pickup order and I just wanted to let you all know, just in case you have not done a pickup order before, um, it is the most convenient thing for me. I do some meal planning at times and so what I love most about the pickup option, um, you can put your meal plans in, um, you know, write them down, write all your ingredients down and just go through the app, put your item in there that you're looking for. It pulls up all of the different types of items that uh, relate to that category and you can choose the different sizes, um, you can choose the different brand or whatever that you want. So I love that aspect of it and I just love how convenient it is. If you guys didn't know, I am a mother of three. I have a 16 year old son and two daughters ages two and three. And so it's very hard for me to get away from them to go and get those grocery items. And I really don't wanna take them into the store at this time um, because of, you know, because of the pandemic, we won't go into all of that, but um, I prefer to keep them at home or in the car if I'm going to the grocery store, just because they don't, um, they don't like to keep their mask on. So to avoid all of that headache, um, definitely do a pickup order. Now I have done pickup orders with HEB. I have done pickup orders with Walmart. I've done them with um, Sam's and Costco. I've also done them with Aldi's. I will say this, uh, my best time to pick up my orders for HEB is early in the morning. And the reason being is because at our HEB, it has a lot of traffic from the time that they open to the time they close. So they run out of a lot of things. So I find that I have less substitutions or less removed items from my pickup order when I pick up those things like at their earliest slot. And so today the earliest slot was, I believe 7.30, eight o'clock. As soon as they open, they're doing a pickup order. So that's my tip for you guys. If you're doing a pickup order, pick up as early as you can so you can get the items that you requested. And you don't have to worry about a sub or you don't have to worry about them removing something because they don't have it. So um, yeah, without further ado, we're gonna go ahead and check out everything that I got. Um, if I have some of the prices, I will let you know. I'll pop them up at the bottom of the screen, but if I don't, do apologize, I'm so sorry. Um, like I said, I did get the items picked on the app and so they had the prices on there. Um, I don't have a hard copy of the receipt. The receipts are always generated by email or in the applications that you're using. So again, without further ado, thanks so much for tuning in, stay tuned. Okay, you guys, so I have gotten everything out of the bags and I'm gonna go ahead and start to let you all see what I got. Um, if you hear the background noise, my little ones are in the backyard with my teenager and girl, they are just playing. So that's what you're hearing. You're hearing a lot of ruckus, a lot of banging and clanging of stuff because they're back there playing. So I do apologize about the background noise. So let's get into it. This is everything that we got. And this will probably last us about three weeks. We are a family of five. And I did do some meal planning on this. So I'm gonna let you guys see what I got that I planned out. Okay, so to start, the first things that I have here, um, I got these maple breakfast sausage and they're fully cooked. You guys, these are amazing. Um, we usually will eat eggs and a breakfast sausage and some type of fruit for breakfast. So this is gonna last, my whole family, we're gonna eat eggs and sausage and a fruit for breakfast. Um, I went ahead and got a thing of grapes. I did pick these up from Sam's. These are the candy snaps. I haven't tasted these before. I got strawberries, two large avocados. I actually requested five limes and um, they only gave me one so I don't know, maybe it was something on my end that I didn't click right, and that's okay. I have that. I did get the big bag of lemons from Sam's Club. I also picked up the bananas from Sam's, the mandarin oranges, uh, pillies from Sam's as well. And um, I got this buffalo style chicken breast, which is delicious, and the hickory smoked turkey. So for lunch, we're gonna be doing um, 
On some days, we're going to be doing sandwiches. So, I got that uh, meat and I got the Colby Jack cheese as well as, um, so I got this. I also got the croissants from Sam's because on some days we're gonna be doing sandwiches. I went ahead and picked up the big box of Lay's baked chips. And this is just gonna be a healthier option for my whole family because we're trying to make a little more healthier options and just eat at home versus eating out or eating the full fat versions of everything. So we have the baked Lay's uh, chips. I got two of those. And this is the, this is the 30 baked mix 30 bags um it comes with all of those flavors i'm sure y'all are familiar i also picked up two of the 36 count large eggs um, we're gonna scramble some and we're gonna boil some we may use some in something else but we definitely eat a lot of eggs picked up two things of the white bread and these are mainly for my daughters um for peanut butter and jelly for my daughters and my son they like to have the peanut butter and jelly at times, so this is something that I'm going to be using to make some at-home Uncrustables. And I'll show you all that in another video. Um, we have the asparagus. I'm going to be doing some meal prep. This is a very good rice that we like from H-E-B as well. It's a Mexican rice. I picked up some blue cheese, some Colby Jack shredded some Swiss shredded for my salads. I went ahead and got the grilled chicken breast again for those fajitas that I made. And I think the last video, if you didn't see it, I did um, some fajitas with this type of chicken breast, the uh, sliced grilled chicken breast, just like this. I also picked up the cheese tortellinis. These are very good for my daughters. I can just add a little bit of Alfredo. And this is the one that I picked up I got two of those. I also got the grill and ready chicken chunks, which is good for my salads. Another uh, easy meal to go to as well. I got a bunch of baby broccoli florets because we just love broccoli. Um, I did get the mushrooms. We're gonna use some in the fajitas. I'm gonna use some in my um, eggs. It's a very good protein. It is just, um, these are the thinly sliced Monterey so these are good for salads, everything. I got cilantro. Um, I also picked up these scrumptious or scrumptious mini cucumbers. My girls love those. I can slice those up and just give them to them with some dressing. I got these little mini potatoes to go with the stew. And I picked up two of these. That'll be a quick and easy meal. I got the baking potatoes. So we're gonna do baked potatoes and probably some baked chicken. I picked up two easy quick salads. This is the Endless Summer, which is delicious. It has the Swiss sunflower seeds, romaine, red cabbage, summer vinaigrette, herbs and spices, and artesian style croutons, as well as carrots. This one is very yummy. This is another one that's delicious as well. It's the sweet Thai salad, chopped salad kit at H-E-B. I got bananas. I don't think I told y'all that. I think I did already. And um, this is another chicken that I got. The lemon garlic grilled chicken. Very yummy. I think I'm gonna cut this open and do a stuffed uh, grilled chicken with this. For our meal preps, I got some salmon. Um, these are just the the tray pack of um, fresh salmon, and that was $15. I got the um, chicken thighs with the bone in. My son loves when I make this uh, jerk chicken style uh, chicken thigh, and I put it on the grill, and I make a yellow coconut pineapple rice. I use this rice, and I got, um, yeah, I got the pineapples. I also got the coconut milk because what I do is I marinate the chicken. And I'll show you all that as well if you want to see that in another video. Uh, let's see what else I got. For breakfast, the girls like the little Smokies. I got sour cream. Um, 
I also picked up the ground chicken breasts here. Oh, I got tea. I got equal for my coffee. I did pick up some parsley. This is a yummy salad dressing I'm gonna be using on my salads. I have to go ahead and get some more dilly dill pickles. I'm gonna be doing some balsamic honey glazed carrots. So I got the balsamic, I got the honey, and this is a number, this sauce is so good. I'm gonna be um, marinate some of that salmon in this and doing it with a stir fry. I got ginger. Um, let's see what else. I had some other little items. Oh, here we go. I got the Lighthouse freeze dried chives. I love chives. I also got some of the sesame seed oil by Kickabon. It's a hundred percent. And then I got the Lighthouse homestyle ranch to go with the cucumbers. I did get some jasmine rice for that stir fry. And for that salad I was telling you about that I'm going to be making with strawberries, I got this here. I still need to get my cranberries and stuff from Aldi. I just like to get that from there because it's cheaper and it's the same thing. So I got two packs of the beef stew mix to go with the beef stew. I got the chicken taco seasoning to go with those uh, chicken tacos I was telling you about right here. I also got these um, bag of orig original bag and season for the chicken. That's going to be going with the drumsticks that I have here. I actually got two of these because it was something else I was going to make with this. I have to look at my journal. I wrote everything down in there. Um, oh, I may make the taco soup. Yeah, I have some stuff to make taco soup, but I may make that another day. And that's everything, you guys. So here it is. That is everything that we got. You see there. This is going to last my family at least three weeks, okay? And, and the reason why um, I like to do the meal planning is because you can plan out what you're going to eat, you know, each day. You can have stuff that's left over, you know, so you don't have to cook each and every day. That's why I really like to do the meal planning. And then I like to make a little extra, so... At night, I'm going to cook up some of those breakfast sausages so they'll be done. I'm also going to boil a few of those eggs over there. Um, what else? I can go ahead and marinate that chicken breast there with the seasonings that I have. Okay. I can marinate this as well. And see, you can marinate and freeze it back up as well. If you have the giant... Um, Ziploc bags you can put all your seasonings on everything and put it back up that way when you pull it out You're just throwing it out and popping it in the oven So just to make it really easy for you and I'm gonna come with some meal prep um, Video for you guys in my next video. So stay tuned Okay, the last thing I wanted to show you guys here are my meal prep containers um these are the True Living Meal Prep Rectangle Containers. It comes with the lids and it's a 10-pack. I absolutely love that because I can get our meals in here. I'm only going to meal prep Monday through Friday, okay, because the rest of the days we're going to be at home. Except for my husband. I'm going to meal prep him for six days. And for me, I'm going to meal prep me for five days. And I got two of them. And so, yeah, if you're interested in these, I will try to link them below for you in the pinned comments okay stay tuned all right you guys so that was it now i have the um the task of getting all of these items put away sorted out and made so that my meal prep plans will stick and i'll be able to actually get everything done the way that i plan to so but anyway i just want to say thank you thank you so much for staying tuned to my channel thank you for your support if you're new don't forget to leave me a comment and let me know you're new. Let me know your favorite part of the video. If you pick up any of these items, let me know that too. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And hit the notification bell so that you can be notified next time I do post. Stay safe, stay blessed.